Well, here's a little house in Green Sand Subdivision. Not quite finished. Uh, evidently some sort of tragedy occurred. There's a house on the lot next door that uh, is not finished either. Um, I'll back up and show you the landing here. Again, there's the stairway with a bit of a rock and concrete landing at the bottom. I'll give you a tour of the in inside of the house in just a minute. You've got exposed rafters on the outside. Here's a here's a uh, uh, gutter for the catchment system. Oh, we got a wind coming through here. Okay. You can see the hurricane hangers. All the hardware. Good sized rafters. guessing that uh, that right there was going to be the uh, ingress, egress, uh, the egress window that they require. If, it's, if you have a bedroom, uh, this is one room, so I guess one, uh, one uh, window would be sufficient. Anyway, here's the, uh, the deck outside. Nice view out there. A little bit, a little bit foggy out there today, but uh, you do have a nice view of the ocean from here. And, uh, bit of a backyard, backs up to a rock wall. Don't know if that's an ancient rock wall or some sort of historic thing or, or what. sized header all the way across and uh, appears as though there's a building permit stuck to the window. Unfortunately I can't see it. This is the back side of it. It's uh, facing outside but it does say building permit on it. Even though I had to read it backwards. <coughs> Looks like you might need a bit of blocking up there <coughs> to catch the, <coughs> the drywall. One interior wall. Don't know where they had planned to put the bathroom, but it looks yeah, it looks kind of like there's something going on right there with a plate, and uh, not plate, but a channel or whatever you want to call it to catch the to catch a wall of some sort. So maybe they were going to put the bathroom in there. Don't know. Anyway, not a bad little place for fifty-five thousand. You can see. Outside, uh, you can see there's the catchment tank, and then uh, power evidently has been paid for. That's the temporary permanent power pole, and uh, the lot has been uh, graded. It could use some uh, finer materials to make it easier to walk, but uh, not a bad little place for the price, especially. appears to be larger acreage behind it so you wouldn't uh, necessarily have any neighbors uh, out there. And again there's the, uh, the unfinished home next door. I don't know what the story is on that one. 
there does not appear to be anyone living in it. The door the slider is open and the deck's not finished. Kind of an unusual shaped house. Anyway, not a bad place.